Okay. Now listen. I am a novice when it comes to relationship. Generally, I suck. I don't have patience for relationship. I'm not that good in it. And it's not about me. I mean, I want to talk a little about relationship. But I want to talk about one relationship I found in the Bible that is so sweet. And I love those couples so much. The parents of Solomon. I'm sorry, I don't, I don't say their name. But, you know, so, um, that's Solomon. God, no, please. The parents of Samson, okay? Samson parents. <laughs> Good. To me, they are the best couple in the Bible. The way they understand each other and the way they cooperate, they are like twins. <laughs> and I was like, how come? If you want to know what I'm saying, go read about Samson. Yeah, you, you can browse I'll write, I'll write where you get the story of Samson in the description box, okay? If you're interested in reading the story of Samson and the parents' story. Now, listen. The mom of Samson was barren and she was still staying with her husband. I mean, I mean, it's, it's like heaven. For you not to have a child and still your man is still with you. I mean, it has to tell a lot about the man's character and who the man is. And the woman, oh God, I don't know how to explain these couples. They are so perfect. And the angels of the Lord was looking for a family to, to raise something in and met the wife of Sam's elf of the wife of the, the mother of Samson and told her, you will give bread to a savior that will save the people of Israel. And she was so happy. She ran to her husband and told her husband. The husband did not doubt the wife. I mean, you have to know the level of their spirituality because they are not doing things carnally. They are so high and in the same level spiritually. Oh my God. You need to understand the story. You need to read the story of Samson and his mother and parents, and his Samson's parents. This couple are the best. The way they do things like they read each other's mind. And when in this in the, when they're supposed to be doing otherwise because they are barren. Let me tell you. Tip in getting the right partner. Get your twin from another mother. Get your twin from another mother. That is how you succeed. I don't have not yet succeeded in my relationship, but you know what? At least I found that puzzle. I have fixed the problem. Get your twin from another mother. I don't mean your twin in the way you look or in the way you work or in the way you speak. I mean your twin up here. Your twin in spirit. Get that person. And my dear, congratulations. You have found your partner. See you in my next video.